In this video, let us look at this uh, apparatus. It is chloroscope. So basically, what are you seeing here? This is a chloroscope. It's actually called a Sendel's chloroscope. What is the purpose of this instrument? To test the presence of free residual chlorine sample of drinking water. So you are trying to look at what? Chloro, chlorine. Remember, free residual chlorine. You want to check the free residual chlorine in water sample. How much chlorine is there in water sample? So basically, usually after uh, bleaching, putting bleaching powder in the water and giving the contact period of one hour, right, to disinfect the water, after the end of that, you want to check the free residual chlor chlorine, right? So what should be the level of free residual chlorine in drinking water? It should be minimum, right, 0.5 milligram per liter of water okay so this is the free residual chlorine so how will you use this so what they will do they will take the chlorinated water sample they will take it in a glass tube okay after the contact period like we told you so what they will do to this water they will add a chemical reagent the color which is formed it will be observed after five minutes the formation of yellow color normally indicates the presence of chlorine okay it can be either combined or free chlorine the more the yellow color, right, the more the yellow color, the greater chlorine resid uh, residual, okay. So, more yellow, more chlorine residue, okay. So, basically, you will add some indicator. Take the water and you will also add some indicator, right, or a chemical reagent they are calling it as. Look at the bottle here and what instructions it says on it. Let's try to read this. This is a chloroscope. They are saying put something here. Okay. So yet another brand of chloroscope here. To estimate the residual chlorine in water it's written. Then what else? So they are showing here the apparatus has some color. Orange, yellow, Right? Looks like the reagent is nothing but orthotoludine only. Look at this. Can you see here? Orthotoludine only it is. So here they have told you. In the box, what is there? This even comes with the instruction sheet as to how to use it. Okay? The readings are 0 0.1, 0 0.2, 0 0.5, 1, 1 1.5 and 2 they are telling here. Right? Can you see here? They have written the readings. So it is pretty clear if you look at this chart. So it's pretty clear here. This will be 0 0.1, 0 0.2, 0.5. This is what you normally want, right? 0 0.5. Then you have 1, 1.5 and 2. And here they are saying if the yellow is darker than the top standard color disc, then the residual chlorine is higher than 2 parts per million. So this, this chloroscope is nothing but it is using orthotoledine reagent. Same thing only this. So if you remember in Horox apparatus, in that video, we have already seen this. So what will you do with, uh, you will calculate the amount of bleaching powder, put it in the water, etc. However, contact period, after that, after contact period, you will do the orthotoledine arsenide test. So that is nothing but, uh, you can use a chloroscope if you want to determine the color. Okay. As simple as that guys, so we are done with chloroscope. Bye-bye.